Okay, here we go. I have a hand that I might or might not have opened two hearts. In first or third seed, vulnerable. At six fours, I like to bid. But, you know, I do have some standards. I need a ten of hearts or ten of clubs. I would probably pass. But, that's the way it is. The modern people would open two hearts. Uh, I'm not that modern. But meanwhile, Gary has opened a spade. So I'm going to bid a forcing no trump and hope he doesn't bid something foolish like three spades. And maybe I'll be able to get my hearts in. And, oh, East has been locked out. Lee's back. Maybe he has enough to overcall two hearts. That would be nice. No, so I will bid one no trump forcing. <coughs> Part of two over one. I will try to get out in two hearts. If we play one spade, three hearts is invitational. I do not have enough to do that. Here comes Gary, the overbidder. Three diamonds. Wonderful. So, I will bid three hearts. Maybe he can raise that. I don't know. He's going to bid three spades. No, no, three no. Three no. So, well, he hates it when I run from three no. I guess I'll let him second. I have a feeling it's right to bid four hearts. But uh, he might not have any hearts. How can I bid? <coughs> well, it's not my problem. I'm guessing... He's five, one, four, three. It could be five, one, five, two. That's something. He likes to bid more clubs. But, I mean, I have really no choices in the matter. Loosen up. Here comes the jack. Oh, what's it going to be, Drew? You have to lead. It's part of the game. Exchanging pleasantries. Nobody's leading. Oh, Alan is on lead. <laughs> My goodness, I have to play this hand. Oh, I should have bid something else. Is anybody going to lead? There goes the three of clubs. That's a wonderful hand you have, Gary. So let's see. I have three club tricks and four spades of seven or diamonds eight. Maybe I can force them to do something for me. I don't know. I'll play the nine. Oh, well, I suppose that helps. I know how to wait now. Well, I'm not willing to take any spade finesse, so I'm just going to play the ace, king, jack of spades. Take three clubs, four spades, a diamond, and a heart. I'm lucky. Please follow suit. Oi. Oi. 
that is bad. So, <coughs> what do we know now? We know we're in trouble. So, let me see. Let's recount our tricks. Three spades and a heart is four. A diamond is five and three clubs are eight. No one's, no one is going to give me a ninth trick with the king or an eight of spades. Right? So we're going to play a little ping pong here. Well, for the time being, I guess I'll throw it up. Throw it up. In the ten of spades, and there she is, the hearts. In case the king drops, which it doesn't, and an eight of spades. Oh, we have a four of spades. That's annoying. I'll put another heart. In case I want to set up my heart problem. Meanwhile. What's Gravesy throwing over there? The eight of diamonds. So he's got three clubs left and three diamonds left. So what can I do? Oh, man. I can almost do something. Those clubs are blocked. Otherwise, I can win the ten of clubs, cash the ace of clubs, and lead a diamond. Well, I can't do that. I can't win the ten of clubs. So, it looks to me like I'm going to win. to my hand, and he's, I'll make the king of diamonds for sure. <coughs> so, I don't know if I would have made four hearts, but what can I do? Couldn't really make this, oh, and the ace of diamonds is right. Playing, playing that. I will make a trick. So, I don't see what I could have done about it. Maybe I could have made it. Maybe I couldn't. It's too bad spades in this game. Poor husband. Okay, I better stop recording.